Okay, hello everybody. So we have here an example of case three. So um, we have here y double prime plus four y prime plus seven y is equal to zero. Now, if we follow the same methodology um, to getting the auxiliary equation from the first, uh, from the previous examples, then we will get m squared plus four m plus seven is equal to zero. Okay, so now we need to what we need to do now is to find m. So uh, we can use the quadratic formula for that. So m is equal to um, negative 4 plus minus, so b squared, that will be 16, minus 4ac, 4 times 7, because a here is 1, so that will be 28, right? 28 all over 2a, uh, since a is 1, this is 2. Okay, so negative 4 plus minus uh, square root of 12 all over 2. Okay, so um, negative 4 plus minus uh, 2 square root of 3 all over 2. Then um, we can simplify this further by... Um, Cancelling out the 2, so we will get m1 is equal to negative 2 plus minus square root of 3, and m2 is equal to uh, negative 2. Oh, I'm sorry, so m1 here is a plus, and then m2 is minus square root of 3. Okay, so here we have our two uh, conjugate complexes. Okay, so let's review the, the format of this uh, root. So we have alpha uh, plus minus square root of, uh, I mean, I'm sorry, so this is. Um, beta x, right? Beta x. So if we take a look at our roots here, our alpha is equal to negative 2, and our beta is equal to square root of 3, right? So square root of 3 and negative 2 here. Okay, so now uh, if we want to find our general solution, then we will just substitute these values to the one that, to the general form that we derived in the previous video. So what we, uh, let's recall the general form. Uh, let's use y here, so y is equal to c1 e raised to alpha x cosine beta x plus c2 e raised to alpha x um, sine of beta x. Okay, so uh, let's substitute these values. We get c1 e exponent alpha x and then, oh, I sorry, forgot. So this is um, negative 2x and then cosine uh, square root of 3x plus c2 here is negative 2x and then sine square root of 3x. Okay, so there you have it. This is our general solution. Okay. Okay, so thank you for watching this video and see you in the next one.